friends, it's Miss Linda here, and we are going to read this book. It's called Owl Babies. Um, before we start reading, I want you guys to say with me, this is the title. This is the front of the book, back of the book, and this is the spine. So let's say it one more time, okay? Title, front of the book, back of the book, spine. Good job. And before we start reading, I want you guys to think about what you guys would do if your parents, mom, dad, uncle, grandma uh, left you guys at somebody's house and you guys didn't know who they were. Let's begin reading. Owl Babies. Once there were three baby owls, Sarah, Percy and Bill. They lived in a hole in the trunk of a tree with their mother, their owl mother. The hole had twigs and leaves and owl feathers in it. It was their house. So do you guys see? There's one, two, three babies, and then the mommy is in the back right there. So do you guys live in a house filled with feathers and twigs and wood? One night they woke up and their owl mother was gone. Where's mommy? asked Sarah. Oh my goodness, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. The baby owls thought, all owls think a lot. I think she's gone hunting, said Sarah, to get us our food, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. So where do you guys think their mommy went? But their owl mother didn't come home. The baby owls came out of their house and they sat on the tree and waited. A big branch for Sarah, a small branch for Percy, and an old piece of ivy for Bill. She'll be back, said Sarah. Back soon, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. So do you guys see Sarah sitting on a big branch Percy is sitting on a small branch, and Bill's on the ivy leaves. It was dark in the wood, and they had to be brave, for things moved all around them. She'll bring us mice and things that are nice, said Sarah. I suppose so, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. They sat and they thought. All owls think a lot. I think we should all sit on my branch, said Sarah. And they did, all three together. Suppose she got lost, said Sarah, or a fox got her, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill, and the baby owls closed their owl eyes and wished their owl mother would come. And she came, soft and silent, she swooped through the trees to Sarah and Percy and Bill. Mommy, they cried, and they flapped, and they danced, and they bounced up and down on their branch. And their mommy came back. What's all the fuss, said their owl mother. You knew I'd come back. The baby owls thought, and all owls think a lot. I knew it, said Sarah, and I knew it, said Percy. I love my mommy, said Bill. And that's the end of the story. Okay, so that was the end of the story. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And did you guys think about what you guys would do if your mommies or daddies left you somewhere and you guys didn't know where you were? Did you cry like the baby owls did? Well, if we come back to school and your mommies, daddies, auntie, uncle, grandma, grandpa drop you guys off, I want you guys to know that this is a safe place and your mommies and daddies will come back and pick you guys up so you might feel a little bit scared a little bit nervous and that's okay but you will be safe here and I promise your mommy and daddies will come pick you up again so I hope you guys have a good day and join us again for story time bye